it's Prez Bobcat, and I just got back from camping at the tallest mountain east of the Mississippi River, Mount Mitchell. Well, we weren't exactly on the mountain like a bunch of mountain camping lunatics, but we were in the small town of Burnsville, which is like a mile or two north of Mount Mitchell. So yeah, the mountain was just like right there. Every year, sometimes twice a year, sometimes three times a year, me, my brother, and my sister will go with my aunt and my uncle camping somewhere in Appalachia. It Sometimes it's North Carolina, it's usually North Carolina, sometimes it'll be Virginia, South Carolina, sometimes Tennessee, Kentucky, Georgia, or anywhere that's near Appalachia where the mountains on the east side of the United States are. We've never been to Mount Mitchell before, so I decided to record the trip and post it as a travel vlog. I've never done a travel vlog before, so if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll try to post more travel vlogs like this in the future. Also, quick side note, my brother and my sister do not want their faces in the video for some reason. I don't know why. So I'm going to be blurring them out with emojis. My sister is the smiling emoji and my brother is the poop emoji. So that's how you can tell who they are, even though you can't see their faces. All right, enjoy the video. Okay, so we're staying at this cute little spot uh, in the middle on the side of a road. And it's really cute. The lady who, um, it's kind of like an Airbnb for, for camping, and the lady who owns it is really sweet. She brought us some eggs and homemade jam. There's this cute little garden with a water fountain. That tent, I think, is just for um, all of the gardening supplies. Of course, we have that picnic table and all of the chairs around the fire, um, the camper, whatnot. And my favorite part of the whole place the hot tub this camping spot has a hot tub never been to a camping spot with a hot tub before it's awesome hot tubs are awesome this is what the back of the site looks like nothing too special still cool though yep and there's a rooster who thinks he can sing but he cannot y'all look at what our view is this is burnsville north carolina going up Mount Mitchell. Look at that. Beautiful. Look at that, folks. Oh, that's not it. I thought it was over there. That right there? That's the highest point east of the Mississippi River. It's Mount Mitchell, North Carolina. Proud to be from North Carolina. Look at that. Ain't that beautiful? Get a load of this, fam. Look at this. This looks like something out of a dream. We're gonna be hiking this trail. Sam, what you doing? You're playing with the tree. Whoo! Picnic tables to get some good munchies. What does that sign say? I can't see it because of the freaking leaves in the way, but let's read that. Hikers and backpackers, rare and endangered plants and animals ahead. Stay on trail. Camp only at Deep Gap, four and a half miles north. We're about to do this trail, y'all. Guess there's nothing to do but just get into it. Oh, look at my shirt. I'm perfectly matched for the environment. Look at this trail. Look, it's so green and mossy. Look at this. We're following the trail markers. Okay, look at what we found. There's wild raspberries here and they're delicious. Oh my goodness, they're so good. Look at this view though. Oh my god. Oh, look at these raspberries. We even found a blackberry. Isn't that awesome? What's up, y'all? We're just sitting on a giant rock. Waiting for the rest of our group. Siblings are being annoying, per usual. That red mushroom right there. We just came across folks, oh my goodness. Alright, so we're currently on Mount Craig. Altitude 6,663 feet. Named for Locke Craig, who lived in 1860 to 1924. Who was governor of North Carolina from 1913 to 1917. He was largely responsible for the establishment of the Mount Mitchell State Park. That's awesome. All right, guys, we're on our way back to the car to get some lunch. Absolutely beautiful view. The whole trail on its own is 11 miles, and yeesh, we're not doing that. But yeah, it was absolutely gorgeous. There was wild, bla wild raspberries, wild blackberries, and they were amazing. They were delicious. The raspberries were so good. Yeah, right, guys, look at how blue this berry is. Look at that rock though. Imagine making like a little secret base in there. We were downhill 
coming and now we're uphill on the last stretch pretty hard Whew. made it back increased bear activity i didn't know there was bear activity that was an awesome trail y'all should check it out all right starting to climb mount mitchell it's 600 yards straight uphill yay and we made it mount mitchell highest peak east of the mississippi 6,000 684 feet. Let's check out that view. Where we are right now in North Carolina, right there. There's a lot of fog. Big Butt Mountain. That's Big Butt Mountain. <sighs> Only in North Carolina. On the way back, y'all. Look at that view. All right, what's up, y'all? We're in the back of the truck with the truck with this crackhead. We're about to go to the creek. You're mental. Mentally genius. Correct. Now we're walking through this creek, looking specifically for mica, which is like a rock that looks like shiny and it looks like gold, but it's not really gold. It's pretty much fool's gold. Let's see if I can find something so I can show you what I'm talking about. Right here. This is mica. Very shiny. This is all of the mica I found. Got some pretty good pieces. This is a rock that has mica all in it and then we have some smaller pieces right here pretty good haul you guys welcome to north carolina we're on another trail samuel's here um he's struggling with oxygen i'm doing fine i guess i just don't need as much oxygen and the rest of the group is just huffing and puffing behind we're gonna take the fire tower way not the campground way because that looks more promising willie jean is just zipping around Smelling everything, running and coming back. Leave it. And we made it to the fire tower. Let's see what it's all about. Update the tower's locked, but they're still checking out the view. There are mosquitoes trying to colonize my ears, y'all. So we were just riding around, and look at what we found. There's a creek over there, and there's this cute little abandoned structure right here. Sitting on this thing. Look at that. There's a chimney right there. Look at that. Check that chimney out. Look at that. I wonder what used to be here. Just sitting in a chimney. Oh. Here is the creek. Look at this. Look at the water just frozen. The water is so clear. Such a relaxing noise, the sound of the river. Okay, so we're going up the stream. It's it's really beautiful out here. Just look at the wildlife. It's incredible. Nature is beautiful. And it's time for lunch. We're having a picnic by the creek. This is what's called living. Look at where I'm at. Isn't that beautiful? Why is it focusing on my face? Stop focusing on my face, focus on the background. It's just absolutely gorgeous. Just look at that. Just look at that. Mm. We're throwing the toy fish for the dog. Look at this. He throws it and she chases it. Isn't that cute? Comment toy fish if you made it this far into the video. That way. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful creek. Water, so clear. Uncle is over there fishing. What you fishing for? Whatever bites. Whatever bites. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. 
What are you doing, silly Willy? What are you doing? Come here. Come here, Willy Jean. If you ever go to a lake like this and you want to wade in it, remember to bring more than one pairs of shoes. Because I only have one pair of shoes, tennis shoes, that can't get wet. So please, if you come here, bring boots or flip-flops or something. Be smarter than me. Look at this furry caterpillar that we just found. It was just crawling on my aunt's foot. She shook it off. Pretty sure that most yeah, it's a, it's a most hairy caterpillars you're not supposed to touch because they have like an irritation poison in the hairs. That's like your defense mechanism. Or I know something. William. I'm gonna name you William. Hello, William. My sister caught a little inchworm. Sure. It's William's friend. I'm gonna name it Willis. And the puppy off after a long day of swimming. Swim like a champion. I don't think I mentioned that a lot of the time when we're just driving. Whenever we can, we'll just hop in the back of the I'm truck instead of actually it. getting in the truck. Oh my god, I hope that's not a cop. Just in the back of the truck, hanging out. All right yeah, guys, right. so we're in the car and we're about to go antiquing. That's basically where we just shop around the town and shop for antiques. Can't wait. Girls. We're done driving and we are in the middle of downtown Burnsville, North Carolina. We're gonna do some shopping around for antiques and whatever cool stuff that we can find. It's a very cute little town. The statue of a dude right there, but I can't read the letters. This water fountain was donated by Junior Girl Scouts in 1975. That's awesome. Whoa. Damn, try the water, it's actually really good. It's the first store we're gonna check out. Um, Teresa B. Brown Digs Home Design Studio. Ooh, those are cool paintings actually, the way they all line up together. Look at this little stool, it's a sheep, isn't that cute? Look at that. Hey, that was a cute store. Fifty Business Toy Shop. Ooh, that sounds promising. Let's check it out. Ooh, my goodness. Press Bobcat, you are 15 years old. You are too old for this stuff. No, I am not. Do not say that ever. Moon balls. Let's see if it actually comes back to my hand. It does not. It's advertising. They have so many board games. Look at all the toy cars. Look at this outdoor stuff. This dartboard. Let's see if I can actually make one. Oh, yes, sir. Shelly beans. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This place is awesome. Really cute. They got so many cool things. Look at that. It's got great atmosphere. I love stores like these. And look at this room in here. There's a very cute fall vibe going on in this room. I really like it. Absolutely brings about, like, November vibes. Very cute. Caution. Wash your step. <laughs> I don't listen to anyone. Oh, God! We got little posters that every southern mama buys for their family home. In this home, your best will always be good enough. Everybody wants to change the world, but nobody wants to change the toilet paper roll. Be the change. Life is fragile. Handle with prayer. I agree. I have a good heart, but this mouth blessed. Good vibes only. Pumpkin spice gives me life. Live gratefully. Kind words are like honey, sweet to the soul. Faith it till you make it. Scatter kindness like seeds. Welcome to our home. Live with intention. Do what you love. Home sweet home. Wait a minute, is that SpongeBob's house? OMG, my mother was right about everything. And life gives you more than you can stand, Neil. The kitchen is the heart of the home. I don't have time to read all of that. Look at these, everybody. They have truffles. They have 15 different flavors. I think I'm going to get some for me and Mama. Got the truffles. Hopefully Mama likes the flavors. These were both really cool stores. I would totally recommend checking these two places out. Look at how cute this town is. Look at that. Magnolia Warren Boutique and Gifts Lamp Post. Vintage Market. And look how cute it is in here. Look at this globe, y'all. Let me show you where we are on this globe. 
We are right there on the globe. Right at that tip of North, where it says North Carolina. Right at there. I don't know why, but I love the spiral staircase in this room. Look at this. Antiquing is an experience. An experience that you'll never forget. This awesome shirt talking about the good things made in North Carolina. That's awesome. A lot of them I didn't even know. Look at all of these different pickled items we got. Pickled hot okra. Pickled eggs? What? Pickled baby corn. Pickled baby beets. That's cool. I think that this cow is trying to say something. Can you hear it? Subscribe to Prince Bobcat. Oh, you heard what the cow said. You have to subscribe. Just pressing two buttons can make my day. It was a cute store. Ham and antiques. Let's check it out. Ooh, look at this. Clippers in a box for $1 each. I mean, that's life for you. You never would know what's gonna happen. The store has like 10 different signs about others' cameras and no shoplifting. Shoplifters will be shot and dismembered. I'm stealing from this store today. Oh goodness, look at these old organs and pianos. Look at these. Look at these. There's posters of Elvis Presley and there's old clocks too. Love this store. Love it. Look at all the ducks and birds. Duck, duck, duck. Goose, goose, goose. This duck looks like it's side eyeing me. Bombastic side eye. Time yep. to go downstairs. There was nothing downstairs. Oh, they got tons of beds. Look at those twin beds. So many chairs. Wow. Our last store, Mountain Time on Main Street. Let's check it out. Ooh, it's a cute place. Oh, look at all these cute paintings. Look at all these. It was the last store, but it definitely did not disappoint. Well, that was the last store, but I had a lot of fun. I got the truffles for Mama, and my aunt and Lillian bought a few things. So, yeah, that's good. Lily Jean is tired from all that antiquing. And as my aunt just told me that there was like a knitting crochet store right around here, where we're about to check it out. I knit, so this is really exciting for me because I love to knit. Comment down below if you want me to post some knitting videos. I've never really thought about it. Here it is. Give me yarns. Let's check it out. Oh my goodness, look at all the yarn. Look at all the yarn. Oh my goodness, y'all, look at this yarn. It's some beautiful colors. And it's so soft. I might get some of it actually. Guys, I think I'm going to get one skein of this wizard blue yarn. I just couldn't pass it up. I'm gonna make a pillow maybe. All right guys, I got my yarn and now we're headed back to the truck. It was a long day but it was so much fun. Getting ice cream from Tulsi Rose. Yes sir. Locally made. That's a good sign. Salted caramel ice cream. This is living. <laughs> Bolt. 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 Alright guys, it's morning on the day we go home. We're gonna leave in like 30 minutes. And I'm really glad we got to come here and see the mountains and go antiquing. It was a really fun trip. Okay, so we're dumping all the crap from the camper. It stinks like crazy. We're trying to shake the rug out and Willie Jean is just obsessed with trying to bite and eat the rug. Look at this. What are you doing, you dumb dumb? What are you doing? Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed my first travel vlog. If you did, please be sure to like and subscribe because this took a long time to edit. I really enjoyed going to Mount Mitchell and Burnsville. It was a really cute town and the mountains were absolutely gorgeous. I'm so glad that I got to see it. It was a fun trip and I would totally recommend visiting it if you're like looking for a place for a quiet scenic vacation. It's a beautiful place to visit and it was pretty cheap and the people were really friendly. I would totally recommend it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see y'all in the next video.